reunion dinner was you plan sit out. <laughs> oh my god. Him. Um. Uh. <laughs> that was um. It's unexpected, I know. Nice. A little strange. You couldn't stop it, nice. Maybe we should stop, period. I'm not sorry. I am, Paul. For what? For crying on your shoulder about Dusty. That kiss was not about Dusty. Does it have to be about anything? I, I hope not. Look, we've we've been out of circulation too long. Tell me about it. And it's natural we'd form a bond. You did save my life. It happens sometimes. Right. You help a patient and you get close to him. I guess I'm just an occupational hazard. Wait, let's not let's not overanalyze this. Okay? Let's not analyze it at all. Better. You good? Because we got more important things to kick around. Like, where do we go from here? I have two options. I can stay and be accused of hiring Madame Moron to break up Jen and Dusty. Or I can leave and maybe have a shot at a half-decent life somewhere. Half-decent? If I'm lucky. <laughs> I'm not feeling very lucky. What about Dusty? Well, he thinks I've got a fatal attraction. Hydro bunnies and stash or butcher knives. Dusty's an idiot. I just told you that. He's a fool. Well, now he's your sister's fool. So, where will you go? Alaska's still out there. Long winters. Well, just one of the perks. Look, I, I don't know where I'm gonna land, and I really don't care. Anywhere but here is looking pretty good right now. And I've got nothing to hold me here anymore. I think you've got more holding you here than you think. Like what? Family? Friends? I'm pretty low on both. We all have our sad stories. I'm not looking for pity. I'm not offering any. For me, being dead has its upside. No more income tax. <laughs> right? No family to disappoint or crazy girlfriends to gun you down. I think, at the end of the day, I would rather have my family love me for being dead than resent me for being alive. It's scary, but I actually get your logic. I have burned a lot of bridges, and I have even less holding me here than you do. So why don't we just take off together? You want to run away with me? You're serious? You, you want to leave town together? Yeah. Why not? Why? Uh, how many reasons did... Two tortured souls really need... Well, that's quite an invitation. I'm just saying, I am as disconnected from my life as I could possibly be, and you are in line right behind me. Well, Mr. Ryan, you are being quite charming today. Okay, look, I haven't gotten to the good part. It's okay. I'm alone. And you're alone. be alone together. I think it could be fun. In a, you know, non-committed kind of way. What do you say? We could get a map and just pick a spot. I say I'll get the map. <laughs> you won't regret this.
<laughs> Not so fast. What do we say first? Please. And what else? Pretty please with sugar on top. Mm -hmm. No sugar until you say what I want to hear. Okay, you have to give me a hint. Am I the only one for you? Yes. Yes. I've forgotten all about Emily. You're the only one that I dream of. And you're all I ever want. Dusty, it's Emily Stewart. Call me as soon as you get this message. There's something you and Jennifer need to know right away.